A bold, visible painting splashed across a Milwaukee County bus. On one side, immigration and customs enforcement agents separating children from their parents in Milwaukee. On the other, hands reaching out to touch an ICE officer, next to a guide listing what to do if ICE comes to your door. The display is a group art project by the Milwaukee Art Museum's summer interns. They've done it for the last 17 years and pay for an ad space on a transit bus for the public to view. It's an opportunity for them to have a platform to use their artistic voice to comment on an issue that's important to them in the city of Milwaukee. Over the years, they've covered social issues from gun violence to mental illness, but this year's is getting special notice. County Supervisor Dan Sebring calling for its removal, saying it's, quote, an offensive abomination and a slap in the face to law enforcement officers and officials at every level. Supervisor Sylvia Ortiz Velez has another take on the display. I see the fear, the very real fear of our neighbors um, and the people that have been living in our communities, some of them almost their entire lives. But I also see the rights of our Constitution. Bus rider Eugene Dungeon feels indifferent. It's not going to influence me one way or another. At this time, the display is expected to remain on the bus for about a month and a half. When we reach out to MCTS, they referred us to the Art Museum, who emphasizes this does not represent its position. We don't censor artists. It's a policy of the museum. Uh, we provide a platform for these teens to express their visual voice and to do that in a public realm. We put a poll up on our website on whether or not you think political messages should be displayed on county property. We'd love to hear your opinion. Reporting in Milwaukee, Lauren Linder, today's TMJ4.